Well, guys, the new big bad for Stargirl Season 2 is revealed to be Eclipso, and I gotta say, his design is badass. What's up, YouTubers of the world? Mega Geek Mixer here to give you guys my expressions and thoughts on the new on the new design for the new big bad for Star Girl Season Two coming soon, and that it would be Eclipso. And like I said, it is freaking badass. I'm telling you guys, when I see, when I saw this thing, I was just like, that's Eclipse Eclipso. This guy looks yes insane. Now, if you guys know him, he's one of the big villains in DC. If I remember correctly, he's an incarnation of God of Wrath or Vengeance or something like that. And all I know is that when the Justice League has faced him, along with I think other people who have faced him, it's not been an easy fight here. Uh, I get. The last time I can remember, though, any in any iteration I saw him in was in Justice League versus Suicide Squad, the com the comics, and even then that guy really brought down the world and really and really just took over a lot of the Justice League members. That in the end, here you see Batman working with the Suicide Squad, and they're the Justice League. So the mere fact that the, this guy will be the big bad going into Star Girl season two, all I'm just gonna say is Star Girl and the New Justice Society of America, they have got their work cut out for them against this guy. Because the last we saw that hinted to us about this guy was in the end of season one, like the it was it showed uh what was her name again uh shiva yeah i believe that was her she had found a diamond and there was something inside of it and i'm pretty sure even i i had mentioned that that was eclipso and yeah they decided to just go with that but then there's also the fact we got to remember we had we had shade show up at the end of season season one showing that maybe he will be in it too but he's not the big bad oh no it's gonna be eclipso and by the way the guy who's playing eclipso is also the same guy who played captain boomerang in the Arrowverse. that being nick tarbe and i got and all i gotta say is like i said the way he looks just looks freaking badass the the elf the elf look with the whole debt with the whole skin and you can just tell he represents evil and then of course there's the fact that he's got that jewel right there on him and guys all i can say is all i can say is i can't wait for season two to get here much less i can't wait till we see a trailer for this so we can really see the sort of special effects and sort of personnel and portrayal that nick is going to bring as he's going to play this villain and much more so what will his goals be because with season one we had the jet the injustice society doing something to stop like global warming and stuff like that but by taking over people's minds and stuff and frying their brains in the process and all that and by that i mean adults mostly not kids in general and stuff and i will say though that even though that's not really as big of a well, better yet, it is kind of a big threat, but I don't know if it's going to be as big a threat as whatever Eclipso is going to bring to the table. And that one's going to be on a whole nother level, which I believe makes sense because whenever it comes to the next seasons after, you got to have a villain who can go up the higher stakes of of threatening the world or threatening a hero's life and so on and so forth more than the previous villain. So you can definitely believe that that whatever it is Eclipso has, it's gonna pay, make make like season one's villains be like nothing. And speaking of season one's vil, villains, though, I wonder if any uh, uh, more of them will be showing up because I'm pretty sure mo most of them were able to get away. Some of them not. Some of them are dead. And then there's in the fact that with Icicle with Icicle now dead, what about his son? Will he become Icicle Jr.? And will he become a villain? Because there is also the fact that Shiva could could show up. I mean, not Shiva. Uh, that's Shiv. Yeah, Shiv. My bad, guys. Either way, though, I could see her maybe going 
going and recruiting Kim and maybe recruiting um, Sportsmaster and Tigress's daughter because we've already seen that she is a very competitive person and and but and in a way that's good but in other ways that's a bad temper on that girl so ooh we you gotta expect something's coming on that one but that's gonna be all I'll talk about for today guys on this one at least with this because this was all about Eclipso we got nothing more than the fact of the design which as I said badass love it love it love it and i can't wait to see nick's portrayal of it this should be good but until then guys if you enjoy my videos all you gotta do is click that like button subscribe to the channel hit the bell icon to be notified when i make more videos and until then Mega geek mixer signing out bye